Hi there, this is Corey, the creator of SAS Pegasus, and today I just wanted to do a very quick walkthrough of what it looks like getting up and running on a new Pegasus project. Um, so I'm at sasspegasus.com, and the first thing I'm going to do is sign into my accounts. Uh, cool. Um, and so I've already purchased a, a Pegasus license, and, and once you have a license, you'll, you'll have this downloads area where you can see the different releases of Pegasus. Um, and, and for now, I'm just going to click get the template. And this is going to download this zip folder onto my, uh, my computer. The zip folder will have the, uh, all of the code in, in Pegasus. Um, and while that's downloading, I'm going to go ahead and set up a new virtual environment for my project. Um, and for this project, I'm going to uh, pretend that I'm making an app for uh, couples to plan their wedding. Uh, so I'm going to say uh, make virtual env. Uh, I'm going to make sure I'm using Python 3, uh, and I'm going to call it wedding plan. And so um, if you're not familiar with virtual env, uh, it's a way to kind of keep your Python environments on your computer isolated, uh, I highly recommend it, and, and virtual env wrapper, which is uh, what I'm using here, is just a, a nice little way to manage your virtual environments. Um, cool. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to install this installer, and I'm going to do that running this code here. Um, and so this is going to install uh, everything I need to, to start a new Pegasus project. Um, and now I'm just going to run Pegasus, uh, and I'm going to give it the path to the file I just downloaded, which is this one. And so now it's going to uh, run me through a series of prompts about my application. Uh, so project name, I'll put in wedding plan. Uh, project slug, that, that looks good. That'll just be used for, for the code module and, and the directory name. Uh, for the description, I'll say the best way to organize and plan your big day. Uh, my name is Corey. Um, domain name. So for development, I'm going to put in uh, localhost uh, with Django's default port. Um, email and Teams. Yeah, so uh, Teams is a, is a feature of Pegasus that I'm uh, excited about. And, and what it lets you do is collaborate with other people on the same sort of like shared project area. Um, and since you know wedding planning is definitely a collaborative activity uh, with your partner, maybe your mother-in-law, uh, I'm going to say yes for this project. And so now Pegasus has now created a uh, new project in this folder, which is just it's it's the folder uh, called wedding plan where where I ran Pegasus. Um, so we can go into there. Um, we can see sort of what it's done. Um, so it's it's created you know standard Django stuff manage.py uh, your project folder with with settings and other things and, and I'm going to go into the code in, in another screencast um, but for now I'm just going to press on with with the setup um, and so the first thing I'm going to do now is install requirements um, so this is going to install Django and oops, Django and uh, some of the other dependencies for for Pegasus. Um, and that'll just take a moment to finish. Um, next, I'm just going to set up my database. Uh, and by default, Pegasus will just use the SQLite database here in the directory. Um, you can obviously uh, configure it just like any other Django project to use Postgres or MySQL or, or whatever your favorite database of choices. Um, and finally, I'm going to run server. And now, yeah, so my development server is now running. Um, and I'll just go back to my browser and open that up. Um, and yeah, so you can see we've got a new Pegasus project here. Uh, we've got this landing page with, with some top navigation, some buttons. And you can see that some of the stuff that we put in uh, during that setup phase has now been incorporated into this landing page. And that's just kind of to orient you on, on getting your first steps to uh, customizing this project and making it your own. Um, so I'm going to create an account here. Uh, yes, and now, now I'm logged in. 
uh, and you can see, you know, again, there's some account management stuff, there's a Teams area, and, and I'm not gonna go into any of this stuff now, I'm going to uh, go into that in, in another screencast. Um, but yeah, so for now, that's it. Uh, that's how you get up and running with Pegasus. I think it's pretty easy, and uh, I hope this was helpful. Thank you.